Hey guys, it's Roscoe, and on the Space Couch today, I'm going to be reviewing and unboxing this C2B5, the Elite Series, the new Imperial Astromech from Rogue One, which I wanted as soon as they announced that they were going to be doing it. Now, let's check him out. Yes, very nice. Ooh, very heavy in the hand. So, yes, obviously an R2 unit. Let's see. Yep, there's his middle claw. That pops up just at the R2. There we go, he dome rotates. Very nice, I do like this matte black and silver colouring on this model. So yes, slightly different highlights to the R2, although all the details are the same, of course. Yes, I do wonder what this droid is going to be doing. Is it gonna be Rook Bodhi's droid? I mean, I don't know if they have droids, uh, Imperial. Uh, pilots. Maybe it's actually R2 in disguise as part of the plans to steal the Death Star plans. Who knows? Wouldn't that be something? Let's just see what it says on his box. Let's just pop him there so you can see him. <clears throat> Astromechs are typically used on starships to assist with maintenance and repair. Equipped with a variety of tooltipped appendages stowed in recess compartments, these small droids can perform quick and simple repairs as well as co-pilot starfighters when needed. When uh, using writing or a series of clicks, beeps and similar sounds to relay information, these compact droids are essential to the function of aircraft travel. Aircraft rather than spacecraft, that is interesting. Maybe uh, we'll see some new ships, obviously there's a new tie. So yes, C2B5, another droid added to the canon. I wonder what this little guy is going to be all about. I was reading um, as part of the promotional materials for this sort of thing that Imperial droids frequently have their minds wiped, their memories wiped, unlike R2 who's never, of course, had his memory wiped. That's why he was able to sift through all of the details he had and find Luke Skywalker's location on Akto, of course. Yes, this is lovely. It does also remind me a little bit of BT1, the murder bot, you know. So maybe I'll pair this guy with my K2SO and there can be some sort of version of the murder bots, who knows. But yes, this would be good. That would be something I would love to see, actually, would be a leaked series of the murder bots. Because, yes, always room for more droids. And like I say, very excited about this to see what this guy's going to be doing. If he's going to get destroyed or make it, who knows. So anyway guys, that's just my very quick review and unboxing of the latest droid that we know about added to the Star Wars canon, a C2B5, which I mean we know nothing about at all, haven't seen it even in the background of the um, trailer as far as I know. Please subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this content, leave me a comment or suggestion for an upcoming topic you'd like to see me discuss, or like the video.